Hello viewers, welcome back to my another video. Standby mode is one of the best new features to roll out with iOS 17. When your iPhone is in standby mode, it can display various clock faces, your favorite widgets, notifications, live activities and other useful stats. While this feature seems quite useful, many users complain that standby mode doesn't work on their iPhone. In this tutorial, I will show you some effective solution that can help you resolve standby mode on your iPhone. Solution 1. Check if your iPhone supports standby mode. One of the first things you should check if standby mode doesn't work for you is if your iPhone supports this feature. Standby mode is only available on iPhone models that supports iOS 17 which includes the following devices iPhone 14 series, iPhone 13 series, iPhone 12 series, iPhone 11 series, iPhone XS, XS Max, iPhone XR, iPhone SE second generation or later. Solution 2. Ensure standby mode is enabled. Open the settings app. Find and tap on standby. Toggle on standby. You may also enable the always on toggle if your iPhone supports it. Solution 3. Ensure you are using standby mode correctly. If standby mode doesn't work even after you have enabled it from the settings app, there's a chance that you are not using it correctly. In order to access standby mode, you must connect your iPhone to power and place it at an inclined angle in landscape orientation preferably using a charging dock. Solution 4. Ensure that low power mode is off. For that, navigate to settings. Next, tap on battery. Toggle off low power mode. Solution 5. Use an MFI certified MagSafe charger or lighting cable. If you still can't access standby mode on your iPhone, you must check if the lighting cable or MagSafe charger you are using to charge it is MFI certified. If your lighting cable or MagSafe charger is uncertified, there's a chance that standby mode will not work on your iPhone. And you may occasionally encounter the annoying this accessory may not be supported error. Solution 6. Ensure portrait orientation lock is off. To ensure that launch the control center and see if you can find the orientation lock icon in the status bar up top. If you see the given icon, toggle off portrait orientation lock. Solution 7. Force restart your iPhone. If you have iPhone 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15 series and iPhone SE second and third generation do the following steps. Quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until you see the Apple logo. Solution 8. Reset all settings. To do this, launch the settings app. Next, find and tap on general. Scroll down, at bottom, tap on transfer or reset iPhone, next tap on reset, tap reset all settings, enter your iPhone's passcode, in the pop-up window tap reset all settings, again tap reset all settings to confirm the process. This was today's video, hope you like and enjoy the video. Do like, comment, share and also subscribe to Apple Info YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.